We want to pray this morning for those among us who are struggling, struggling physically. Um, we think of Kevin and we want to pray for God's grace for, for him and for several who are fighting the fight of cancer and struggling there. And I'm sure we each have on our hearts things that during the week and in life that can be, be tough. And I just want to remind us that Jesus is Lord of, over those things. So join with me together as we, as we pray as a church. Lord God, we thank you. Thank you for resurrection power. Lord, we thank you that if you can raise Jesus from the dead, you can truly do anything. And so, Lord, I pray for those who are sick. I pray your healing touch, Lord. Lord, whether you work through doctors or just through your divine touch, Lord, we, we commit the sick to you. And Lord, we pray for those who are struggling. We pray for relationships that are, that are difficult. <clears throat> Lord God, we pray for job situations that might be tough. Lord, we pray for physical pain that, Lord, shows no relief. God, would you just show yourself faithful? Lord, bring hope. And Lord, we pray as your church that you would bless us. Lord, we pray that you would be with each church that's proclaiming your word across this great nation today. Lord, and just the, the enthusiasm of the resurrection would just radiate through our, our country and through our very own lives. Lord, let us truly grasp the meaning of what you did for us in paying the price for our sins. And Lord, we pray together as you taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen.